Hey, hello and welcome to this really fun tutorial by Flowmotion. Because today we are going to take a look at all the advanced new features within Wonder Studio. Because now you're not only able to transform your character, but the whole environment. So, just follow me into After Effects. Hi, hello and welcome to this really funny tutorial by Flowmotion. Because today we are going to show you all the new features within Wonder Studio. Animation. So just follow us into After Effects. Yes, you can trust your eyes. This complete scene is indeed a fully 3D scene with the help of AI and Wonder Dynamics. And today I'm going to show you how easy it is to set this up. You may have seen the power of Wonder Studio already. How to film yourself and replace you with a 3D character. And I did a few tutorials on that. And all those features are still there in an improved way. But we have one big new feature and this is called animation. So let's directly click on that. And as we are used to, we now import the clip. Indeed, you could also upload some videos that have multiple cuts and Wonder Studio will be able to spot the right characters in each shot, such as mind blowing. Once uploaded, I can analyze the clip and search for actors. And there are a few new ones available and it also shows you which ones work with the new animation method. Great. So let us pick those two new ones and just be aware that it will track the scene, track the characters, track the hands and finger movements and all the facial expressions. And it does all of this in the cloud. So once you have set it up, you could work on a different project, different stuff, or directly, yeah, start a completely new project. But okay, back to our project. Now, let's add a scene. At the moment, we are limited to a Blanco scene and this one here. So let's use this one. And as before, we can now choose what we want to have in the end. Of course, I want to have the Blender scene camera track and also the final video, the characters and the background scene. Now, all you have to do is wait. And once it has finished doing its AI magic, I can download the video, the textures, the characters and everything we have to find. Just awesome. And yes, the tutorial could already end here, but let's make this a little more advanced by bringing this into Blender. So I open up the scene and here we have our characters. And when we play this, you can see it's full potential. And if you're missing any textures, just go to File, External Data and find Missing Files. And then just choose the folders you just downloaded. And we can now also append our scene here. So we have all in one nice looking file. And we could also add stuff here, work on shaders. But the coolest thing is that we can now adjust our camera. So let's maybe add a new one over here. And now to keep it super easy for all you Blender beginners, let's just go to the position and rotation parameters and look through the camera. And you can switch between the camera and an orbit view by clicking this icon here. If you have found your fitting camera angle, just click on the keyframes over here. Now, go to the point in time where you want to adjust it and do exactly that again. And once you're happy, you can render out your masterpiece or create different cameras and cut them later, which is exactly what I have done here. And by now, they should really call you the new James Cameron, as this is exactly how he is filming his Avatar movies. Filming the scene with real actors in an easy to control environment and then make all of this accessible in 3D and go from there. In this way, there is no limitation to your creativity 
Well, so I'm really curious what you will come up with when using Wonder Studio. And for now, I wish you a lot of fun while being creative.